Hello, everyone. My name is Sandra, and thank you so much for tuning in. So this actually arrived really early. Like, I was shook it, okay? I was shook it that my Macy's beauty box arrived so promptly. I saw the charge on my credit card, or my, you know, my card. I saw the charge on my card, and I was just like, that was very quick. Last month in February, they charged my card like around the 15th of the month. This one, they charged me uh, March 1st or February 20th. They charged me right at the beginning or right at the end. And this box arrived a few days later. I'm very excited to get into this Macy's beauty box and see what she got in store. Okay, what you got for me this time? I just love how this box just like falls apart as soon as you open it. It does come with a little code, a little code for $5 off. I actually don't use these codes. I'm gonna make a community post and if someone wants it, they can just get it first come first serve. Be on the lookout for that. I will post it at some point in time. It'll just be something that we do every time we get our Macy's box. Opening my box, the first thing that I pulled out was this. <laughs> what is this? What are you? At least it's not hair clips. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, this is a little bag. A little bag with a little flap. I mean, you could probably put your phone in that little flat. Well, it might be a little flimsy. All right? You got a case on your phone. This is like a little shopping bag. And it's actually pretty big. Not grocery store big, but like, you know, going to Target big. This is actually pretty nice. And the material's beautiful. Beautiful. No, the material's not. I mean, it's beautiful to look at, but the material itself isn't beautiful. It's a nice sturdy material. It's not too thin. It's thin, but it's not too thin where I'm like, oh, it's gonna rip. But yeah, yeah, this is actually pretty nice. It's useful. I feel like this is something you would just keep in your car where it's like you go to a store because you know nowadays the stores they want to charge you for bags. Some stores don't offer any you know throwaway bags period. I feel like this will be very helpful for those times where you're not thinking you're gonna go shopping but then you end up going shopping and then you're just like oh shoot I need a bag to carry all my stuff out. Boom it's in the car because you got this sucker okay because you've got this bad boy it's in your arsenal ready to go and it's actually not like gaudy a lot of times when you see these bags they're super freaking gaudy and just hideous it's got like this soft color scheme to it you know you got your little blues and pinks it's very subtle so it's not distracting it's not hideous this is a nice little gift okay better than hair clips it's the first little thing we got and then everything else is in here <laughs> so itty bitty that it all fits in here Ooh, this first one feels really nice it's itty bitty but like the the packaging feels exciting Expensive. The next thing in here is the Kadali Kadali Vino Perfect. Serim Eclat Anti Touch. I've read this before. It's more of that stretch cream cream, <laughs> but it looks different. This packaging is definitely much nicer than the one that I got in that old glossy box. Now this one comes with a little, little thingy like this. And this is like a frosted glass. So it's really tiny. I'm not gonna lie. This looks like it's much more than I got in the little squeezy tube, even though I think they're about the same amount based on what it says in here. It says 10 milliliters. Ooh, it's a little squeezy tube like so. And let me just, let me just try a little bit. You could actually get a decent amount of use in, cause this is like a serum, it's a radiant serum. Let me see how it feels on my skin. It has that typical skincare smell. I mean, it feels good. It feels a little sticky. It's not as thin of a serum as I, you know, I'm used to, but it's not bad. I will be putting this on my stretch marks, okay? Cause I definitely got them after baby girl. Next is a little itty bitty squeezy tube. Probably barely got anything in it. I feel like this is mostly air. And this is by Pericone and D is the Hyperallergenic Clean Collection Firming and Brightening Eye Cream. So we got a little itty bitty eye cream and it says you're supposed to get five milliliters out of this. I mean, it's eye cream, so I'm guessing you don't need a lot. Nice little safety seal. So this is what the little creamy cream looks like. It doesn't really have much of a scent, but it feels good. Very creamy. Do my eyes look brighter? I feel like with something like this, you're not gonna really tell a difference in until maybe like a week or two. And I think this is enough product to actually use it for maybe like a week. Cause you don't need a lot for under your eyes. I mean, it's just this little bit of skin right here. So you don't need a whole lot. I don't really have too much of a dark circle, dark eye thing going on, but you know, I like the experience of skincare. So I'm definitely gonna give that some try, some try. I'm definitely gonna give that a try. <laughs> the next thing is by Origins and this is the Checks and Bounces. <laughs> and it says it's a milky, 
oil cleanser and makeup remover. So this is really itty bitty, but it's so cute. I don't really use a whole lot when I take my makeup off because I don't cake on my makeup. You know, I'm not Meredith. I don't use 10 pounds of makeup. This will actually last a decent amount of time and give you a chance to like see if you like the product or not. Let me see if it has a scent to it. It just smells like oil. It just has that, that same like grapeseed oil kind of smell to it. Very nice. I will definitely give this a try. See if I like it. See if it gets the, the mascara off. That is the real tried and true test. Does it get the mascara off? It doesn't get the mascara off, then it ain't. Okay, it don't work. We'll try that out on one of those extreme skincare, nighttime skincare routine things that I do every so now, every so now, every so often. The next thing in here is actually by First Aid Beauty. And I actually have a a few different items from First Aid Beauty now, which is pretty cool. And this is the Pure Skin Face Cleanser. Ooh, you get full one ounce. Very, very nice. And now this sucker got stuff in it, okay? I can feel the product. It's got some weight to it. It's got a little bit of heft. They actually give you a decent amount for you to try. Put a little, little dot. Ooh, okay, not really a dot. It's more of a cream, more of a cream cleanser. I don't think their stuff has a much of a scent to it. It feels good. Yeah, and it doesn't It doesn't have a scent, which is good. I like that. It's just a cute little cleanser. And this is enough to definitely try it out and see if you like it. So we'll definitely be using that on my face at some point in time and seeing how she, how she performs. Did they give us a card last time? I feel like last time they gave us a card telling us how much all this stuff cost. Or maybe that was something else. I don't know. The last thing that I actually got in here is B3 Niacinamide Serum by Sunday Riley. Now I've heard of the brand Sunday Riley. I have yet to try Sunday Riley. So this will be my first time. This box is super cute. I love that pink border. I think that is so adorable. Just absolutely adorable. It's so itty bitty. Look at how cute and itty bitty that is. I mean, you're not getting much product, but it's so cute. I don't care. I'm not gonna lie. I'm probably gonna keep this even after it's empty just because it's so adorable. Five milliliters, okay? You get five milliliters of product and it's just super, super cute. And this is just a nice in my serum. Ooh, see that color? That color is crazy. I was not expecting that color. I mean, I know I have a bunch of other stuff on my face. And usually, you know, you do your serums before moisturizers. Niacinamide is perfect for healing dark spots. For all the hyperpigmentation that's on my face, if you see it disappearing, it's because of that damn niacinamide. And the serum doesn't have a scent to it, which is really good. It feels like it went into the skin very well. I mean, it's just a nice little serum. I'm glad to have her. I need more serums, okay? I'm, I'm a little skimpy on the serums and I'm running out of my Tony Moly, okay? I need to make my purchase and buy the full size because I'm running out of my little sample size of my Tony Moly and I actually really like my Tony Moly. That was everything. Everything in my Macy's beauty box. I actually like this one. I think that this was a really good box. I'm gonna be able to use everything. Nothing in this box looks old. Okay, like last time the lip products looked old. This time around, I think everything is new. I love the packaging on all these little products and you're getting a decent amount for you to try it. I'm not mad at her. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Febe. Like and subscribe so that you can become a Febe. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces.